In the intricate drama of scientific investigation, a revelation of global proportion has unfolded a symphony of 25 studies, 42 levels of impact, and the stories of 1,774 men from diverse corners of our planet. The conclusion is stark and urgent. The presence of pesticide is wreaking havoc on male fertility and it's time to take note and act wisely. Imagine a generation, I mean a lost generation, defined not by their choices but by a silent adversary that rendered them sterile, unable to pass on the true legacy of life. Their crime amongst us, simply indulging in the everyday's act of nourishing themselves with food laden with the residues of later organophosphate and and methyl carbamate pesticides. This seemingly innocuous choice has sealed their fate when it comes to the natural cause of procreation. The saga unfolds in the Journal of Environmental Health Perspective, where Levine and co-authors embark on the global analysis spanning the 20th and 21st century era their findings paint a vivid picture of a tight correlation between the application of organophosphate and carbamate pesticides and a decline in sperm count among men. Picture the land from South to Central America, Asia, Africa to Europe, where these pesticides were randomly and freely applied. Over 50 years, the ability of men to father children has plummeted by staggering 50%. This means that a man who has traversed five decades is left with a mere 1 to 10% chance of producing viable offspring. The gravity of this revelation, yes, scientific, is both profound and alarming. As these individuals, unfortunately for them, grapple with the consequences of their ill fate and dissenting celebration echoes from the headquarters of Big Tech. They applaud their success in producing organophosphate and n carbamates, branding them as safe and effective. A phrase dripping with irony given the undeniable evidence as per Levin's finding that these once tooted molecules of choice has cast a dark shadow on the destiny of men's reproductive health. This clarion call for food safety now echoes with unprecedented urgency, here amplified by Safe Agri Consulting. Why peeling techniques and washing agricultural products can offer a safe heaven by removing residual surface pesticides. The true path to safety lies in vigilance and sourcing of organic foods. In the face of the letdown by pesticides regulatory agencies, the time is ripe for the emergence of independent new food safety rating agencies. This is where Safe Agri Consulting steps in to the narrative. Concluding this chronicle with the promise to safeguard the future of our sustenance. It's a call to action, a plea for awareness, and an emphasis on the need for men to understand pesticide science for their well-being. This marks the end of the weekly chronicle. Welcome to Safe Agri Consulting.